big story we're following tonight. It is going to be one of the busiest travel weeks in history, with AAA expecting record setting numbers on both the roads and in the skies. Good evening. Thanks for being with us. I'm Shay Arthur. Our chief investigator, Jessica Gertler, finds out what you need to do to prepare before you head out of town. Thanksgiving travel officially underway here at the Memphis International Airport. Officials tell us between last Friday and December 2nd, get this, they expect 90,000 people to go through a checkpoint here. The Memphis International Airport all set for a busy week, but even with all hands on deck, officials warn travelers to plan ahead and arrive two hours before their flight, especially if it's between five and seven in the morning. A similar story across the country as the Transportation Security Administration predicts around 18 million people traveling by air, the highest volumes they've seen. Unfortunately, our staffing in TSA is also at the highest levels we've, that they have ever been. Millions expected to hit the road too. AAA reports 71 million nationwide will travel 50 or more miles. That's a million more than last year. It predicts the busiest time on the roads, Tuesday and Wednesday afternoon. The Tennessee Highway Patrol putting extra emphasis on the roads as they post travel tips like checking tire pressure and charging your cell phone. The Shelby County Sheriff's Office told us they're going to be out in full force too, reminding drivers to be extra careful. Did you know the Shelby County Sheriff's Office will check on your residence while you're away on vacation? The Sheriff's Office also reminding folks in the Arlington, Lakeland and unincorporated areas of the county to let them know if they're going out of town so they can check on your home or business and try to offer peace of mind during a week that will be one of the busiest travel periods yet. This year has already been the busiest in TSA history. All 10 of our top busiest days in our 23 years have occurred since the 24th of May of this year. And officials here at the Memphis International Airport tell us they expect some of these parking lots to fill up on those peak travel days. On our way in here, we saw the sign long term parking already full. They say they're going to have signage as well as staff directing people where to go. So just be mindful of that. Give yourself again plenty of time. Reporting for your news leader, Jessica Gertler, WRG News Channel 3.